welcome back to my channel if you're a returning subscriber thank you and if you're new here welcome today's video is all about the hair so i will be teaching you how to gel your hair without having that white cask or mask or ghost <laughs> you know when you gel your hair and there's like that little white 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 bit it's not cute and i'm here today to show you guys how i eliminate those white shadows on my hair so my baby hairs can shine and i'll also be showing you how to make your old hair this is old look kind of decent no just to like rock it i'm gonna be showing you that and before i get into this video if you appreciate that effort can you please give this video a thumbs up and if you're not subscribed can you please subscribe for me right i'm not gonna talk too much i'm just gonna get straight into the video and i will be using this edge booster for my hair this is the one i have been using and it's so good that i bought this first it's finished like there's still some in i bought this first and it was so good and i love the smell so i bought another one <laughs> they had they didn't have the pink one so to get this it's ten pounds or nine pounds depends on the shop but it's really worth it so this is not sponsored this is just me shouting you putting you guys on you know giving you guys the plug yeah so if you have stubborn hair like mine trust me this this when i found this gel my life changed okay so my life as in hair wise i'm gonna start with the front obviously you need your brush teeth brush or you can have one of these that's fine you need to be using the smoker's teeth brush and this brush is so hard it will brush your brains i'm not even joking literally just apply your gel what i like to do i did my brush in the gel right and then did my finger also in the gel so as i brush it <laughs> ignore that as i brush it i back it with this gel so it lays in place do you see it lays in place see how they're all being obedient and i brush it all the way down first and then keep my finger where i want the curve to be and then i smooth it like that and when you put extra gel on your hair like after you've done it you have to brush it out and i say this because if you don't brush out your gel the actual bit your hair bit will look white and it won't look black you don't want that for yourself so well unless you want that brush it out we're doing the same thing over here it's really really easy nice quick and easy process like that be patient i seem fast but that's because i like i'm so used to gelling my hair so pardon me if it's a bit too fast for you literally just don't be afraid when you're swooping your hair just go for it just swoop my eyes watering because my light is so bright but i can't turn it off because you know you know what time it is it's winter there's daylight saving season and the weather itself is not great so there isn't much too much natural light outside so i need uh my light and I have to say a very, very big thank you actually to EK Designs. Ernest, he literally gifted me this light. He's lovely. He's a photographer, videographer, stylist. If you want design, if you want your Instagram to pop, guys, go show him. I will leave his details down below. He's so lovely. And this light has helped me so much. So much, okay? so let's all thank Ernest for that because without him this video would be looking kind of dark so yeah 
how he say thank you to him. When it gets to this bit, I sometimes brush it like this. And when I'm feeling like, oh, let's go for something extra, I sometimes brush it like this. Okay. And I sometimes put it like this. And I sometimes just brush it back. I'm not going to brush it back because I'm trying to get this. I just do this. I brush it back mostly when I'm going to work. Imagine you have a 7 a.m. start. How 7? You're not, you're not now going to start doing swoops and everything. I just do these real quick. And then I brush that one to the side and I'm done. So I'm looking over there a lot because I have a mirror over there. And you guys are here. I can see you guys over there as well. <laughs> Hi guys. Hey. Yeah, so I'm just using that to guide me because I can't see. I'm using the back, the back camera of my iPhone 11 Pro Max. You can do YouTube without a camera, <laughs> okay? You really can. You don't need to buy a camera yet. I mean, if you can buy a camera, do you do it, of course. But if you can't afford it yet or you have other stuff you need to buy just manage with your phone for now okay it's fine so there are sometimes when you gel your hair like some are so forward some are so backwards it's just like you know, i don't know How am I doing, guys? I hope I'm doing well. So I'm just repeating the same process. Just brush all the hair forward. You know, gel with your brush. Gel with your finger. Brush it. Back it with the gel on your finger. Back it. And then you use your finger as a guide and the rest of the hair back and that's how i do my swoop everyone does it differently some people brush it all forward then they take this bit of the other brush or any comb and they just go in sections but my hair is so hard so i feel the need to do it as i go because if i leave it it will be a disaster i've tried it before the word ish ish <laughs> not much so yeah just stick to this to be honest with you I brush this forward. See, right now I'm not I'm not scared about the gel going everywhere because I know I know what to do to it. Like I can get it sorted. It's no problem. So I'm not really bothered. Just brush this bit back as well. This side is probably nicer than this one. <laughs> But we'll just take it as it is. Guys, my skin has come a long way. And I'm like all up in the camera. Like servant skin. But I know that's not a topic for today. But trust me. <laughs> I have a whole video of my skin coming out soon. And if you also want to know. If you want to know how to get your skin looking dewy. Without like makeup like just naturally kind of glowing looks juicy it's not looking dry yeah let me know i will definitely do that video and also you can comment down below but make sure you're subscribed so you do not miss out and turn your post notification on for when i post it so you know how to be looking this dewy and you know it's winter you don't want to be looking dry you don't want to be looking crusty you don't want to always make wear makeup yeah i'll show you the natural way to make your skin <laughs> that sounded like the effect <laughs> right so now that i'm done i'll try to let this dry a bit before i wipe it but mostly i don't have the time so when i'm going to work for example i do not have an extra five ten minutes to let my edges dry i just go straight in and clear these but today i'm gonna try wait a bit so while i wait we're gonna move on to the making your hair look decent your old hair look decent and i bought 
<laughs> I got this and something else. Let me get. So I got this hair mousse and hair wax stick from Empress Beauty Stores. Well, Empress Hair and Beauty Store. That is my sister right there. You know, with the hair products, she sells wigs, bundles, bonnets, um, press, wait, melt bands, you know, so many things. Anything hair, she's got you. Visit her. I will also show her down below. And this is quite new, so I might have to pump a bit more. So we're going to go with, with my mousse. As I said, there we go. My first time. Oh my god, uh, ha! This may smells good though. I'm not even lying. This may smells like a certain sweet. It smells so good. Ah, ah, ah. I'm not even kidding. I haven't smelled a mousse that smells this good before. I am never. I am pumping away. Like it feels very full, full to the top. Wow. And I like mousse that are like this. There are some mousse that's so thick, like barrier. It's so thick. I don't really like that. I prefer these type of ones, like light mousse. And I'm trying not to, you know, get involved with my gel because they have no business together at this moment. I'm trying to get it to dry up. So there's no need for me to now make it wet with mousse. Some people mix it together, like when they do it. And I guess the hair doesn't look away, right, but I don't do it like that. And I haven't done it like that, so... I can't really say much for that. So now they've done that, I'm going to grab my hair scarf. This was gifted to me by Hair Rain on Instagram. She has an Amazon store. Wow, <laughs> this video will be sounding like a a sponsored video at this point, but it's not sponsored. <laughs> It's really, really not. This was sponsored. I already done what I needed to do for the scarf. But I'm just giving her another shout out and shout out because it doesn't hurt, you know, to shout people people that support you out. It really doesn't hurt. It doesn't cost a penny to do that. So I don't mind. So this is by Hair Rain. And she has different colors. See, so cute. It makes a perfect bow. You don't even know how to tie a bow. Like, just tie one knot and tie another knot and you have a perfect bow. See? Okay. Now, I think this is dried enough. But guys, I really love this packaging. Like, the bling. The blink. The bling. Let me show you guys the wax stick. This smells really nice. It smells like candle. I said that on my TikTok. Um... Yeah, it smells like candle. I love it. And you push this bit right over here. You push it and then it comes out. How do I take it back now? <laughs> awesome. <laughs> I didn't know it was going to come out that much. It's feeling strong tonight. Right. So that's that. Empress Beauty Stores, hair and store for all your hair products, wigs, bundles, anything. Show her. Right. Um... So now that that's dry, I'm going to grab this flannel, face cloth, face towel, whichever way you call it. It's already, it's already wet, it's damp, but I'm going to add some more water because I want it a slightly wet, but not dripping wet. I'm just going to pour some water in it. You know, I'm just going to take one small section, add my water. Just kind of pat it down a bit. Awesome. So now I'm going to take one small corner and I'm going to trace my baby hairs. You can already see that as I clean, the white bits are disappearing. Can you see that? So I'm going to come up close and personal. Sorry. 
just this is your face towel right wet it put your finger there okay fold it over now you have something like that take your time be patient because you don't want to rush and get the edges wet because your baby hairs will start lifting but when you're not even outside yet you've not even started taking pictures you've not started doing your snap Eh? it's already coming out you don't want that so be really really patient start with the skin so everything is like nice and smooth gradually work your way backwards like that when you're done with one side go on to the next okay and if you've used that bit enough change it up switch it up okay because then it's just loaded with product and you don't want that so you need to wet it a little bit there we go just a bit again just take your time and wipe 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 it wipe <laughs> right. don't forget to clean your forehead if you have a big one like mine <laughs> you guys can see the difference um <laughs> let's go sort that out <laughs> okay guys i'm back sorry for the technical difficulties i need to fire my um electricians which is going to be myself because <laughs> i have no one i literally did it myself so my feet was underneath the plug so it came out of the extension a bit and it went off imagine imagine that but you guys saw the difference you know so the light is very very good and lighting is so important when it comes to your videos and your pictures so we thank god that was sorted as quickly as possible and we can carry on with our video shout out to electrician amy thank you. <laughs> joking 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 right okay this is still well now Keep tracing it, keep tracing it, keep tracing. Don't forget your sideburns. If you have some sideburns like me, address it. Address the situation. Don't leave it looking crusty. You don't want that. And sometimes I just like literally pat the hair itself a little bit, you know, to help me reach the tiny, tiny corners without disturbing my baby hairs and that's it guys that's it as easy as that that's all you need water gel toothbrush and a face cloth i'm sure you already have these stuff at home don't use tissue because it will rip into your hairs and now you will have another situation on your hands and you have you might have to start again because you have little little particles in there do not use tissue don't say i did not tell you just use one of these okay awesome right so now i'm going to grab my blow dryer let's just keep this recording grab my blow so guys i thought i was done recording i did the end the outro everything only to find out that i was not recording but it's not a big deal so i blow dried my hair for about three minutes or less literally and that's the end result so it doesn't stop your hair from looking old but it makes it look orderly old so there isn't like so much flyaways looking messy from a distance and all of that no it's just to help you, your hair look orderly orderly old not messily messily old <laughs> if i'm talking sense or english at this point because i'm not sure but yeah this is what it looks like and i hope you've learned a thing or two if you did enjoy this video kindly give this video a thumbs up i appreciate this so much and if you're new here please subscribe to my channel and i shall see you in my next video thanks for stopping by love you take care of yourself see ya